Welcome to the 18th elusive target of the game and the first one that is set in Colorado. This is Richard M. Foreman, the chameleon. I do apologize that I sound pretty congested, but I am sick. I guess that's what happens when you deal with sick people all day. I don't know what I was expecting. Good afternoon, 47. Your target is Richard M. Foreman, a skilled infiltrator believed to be working with the militia on an unknown operation on U.S. soil. The target is a highly skilled actor, and our files link him with a successful impersonation of billionaire Charles Vanderblatt, where he siphoned hundreds of millions out of the Vanderblatt accounts over the course of three weeks. The contract has two objectives, identifying and eliminating the target in an apparently accidental death such as a fall or drowning. Secondly, uncover files or data about the operation being planned. The clock is ticking, 47. Good luck. So the target sounds very interesting. Let me read a little bit more about him. Richard M. Foreman is a chameleon without compare, an American by birth. He is a highly successful, confident trickster, as well as a very confident actor. Most recently, he impersonated billionaire Charles Vanderblith for almost a month. During this time, he participated in two annual general meetings and hosted a reception at the Vanderblith estate in New England. He also siphoned almost $100 million from the family accounts before vanishing and leaving the family to face charges of insider trading and a complex legal morass that promises to continue for years to come. The climb requires that the target be eliminated in a manner that will resemble a non-suspicious accident. As the Colorado Militia Camp is a highly alert area, you should avoid using any explosive accidents. You are advised to make use of falls, drownings, or other accidental approaches. There's also this laptop. The target requires any information detailing the militia operation in which the target will be participating. So let's go ahead and get started with this thing. Good morning, 47. Welcome to Colorado. The target is notorious for changing his appearance and mannerisms. You will need to sweep the compound to locate him. Remember, you must eliminate the target in a manner that appears accidental. Avoid explosives, as these are too likely to draw close attention. Good hunting. So I'm just gonna be honest with you guys. Very disappointed by this elusive target. When it was first announced and the details were revealed, I thought that this guy being a chameleon and everything, he would be walking around all over the map, changing his disguise along the way, making it difficult to actually locate and identify him, but that's not the case, he just stays upstairs here in the house, does nothing, doesn't really have any interesting lines, just basically repeats the same thing over and over again, doesn't go anywhere. Pretty disappointing, honestly. 70 seconds, strategic air wing. Air Force General Robert James Cobb, Nellis Air Force Base, 72nd Strategic Air Wing. I got it. So I'll fast forward some lines. I'm here to inspect the G12 fuel air munitions. So it looks like he is trying to impersonate a certain Cobb. He's trying to rehearse his lines for his new impersonation role. Now, son, I am Air Force General Robert James Cobb. You best open this gate right now. That's an order. <clears throat> an order. That's an order. Not much to this, honestly. And again, he doesn't really have that many lines, so I'm going to get to the kill pretty quick here. I'm General Robert James Cobb. You pass that convoy through the checkpoint right now. Right now. Better, I think. I'll have another go. Sure thing. I tried waiting Air here for Force like an General hour. Robert James Cobb. But he doesn't do anything. Air Force Base. 72nd Strategic Air Wing. Except sometimes you'll get the voice of God. Robert James Cobb. Nellis Air Force Base. 72nd Strategic Air Wing. I'll fix it. I'll fast forward some more, I guess. I 
You can see he's basically started repeating his lines. There's no point in me kind of waiting around for him to say anything new at this point, so I'm going to get on with it. There is one thing you can actually force him to do besides just kind of sit there rehearsing lines. And in order to trigger that event, you have to take out both hackers that are here in the room with him. So that's what I'm going to do right now. Just going to try to lure him over here with his soda pop. You know. Knock him silly. And honestly, I don't need to hide this body or anything, but I'm going to because this is a pretty uneventful, elusive target. And I'm trying to make it a little bit more exciting. I don't know. I'm just rambling. So let me go back and take care of the second hacker. Actually, I'll go ahead and take the files right now. That's one of the objectives. And once the hacker comes to this side, I'll go ahead and knock him out. I'm on it. Hopefully he won't take too long. So you can jab him with a lethal poison syringe when the hackers aren't looking. You can jab him with an emetic syringe and try to lure him in the bathroom and drown him. There's a few things you can do, but I'll show you one of the safer things, I guess. Nobody's gonna come back here, so there's no need to hide his body or anything. So again, if you take out both the hackers, you trigger that little dialogue there and the target actually leaves and goes outside towards the balcony I'm gonna wait for this patrol to make it downstairs before before I follow the target that way I don't get spotted make sure he turns and it's all the way downstairs there you go and he's kind of peering over the balcony so easy accident kill right here target down so now I'll just get the mask here so I can make my escape And it doesn't matter that the body is found since it was an accidental kill, so I'm still in the running for Silent Assassin here. So overall, pretty easy, pretty uneventful, pretty uninspiring, pretty bland, elusive target. It's not often that I'm disappointed, but I will admit it today. Kind of disappointing. Just gotta wait for these guys to turn around. It would suck, absolutely suck, to get spotted right before the exit and lose the Silent Assassin. If you remember, in the last elusive target, I didn't get Silent Assassin because of a stupid bug. Stupid lady saw me through the floor. It was ridiculous. I want to make sure I get Silent Assassin this time. Alright, thanks for watching, guys. Appreciate all your support, and I'll see you on the next episode.